It's summertime and the living's easy. Bradley's on the microphone with Ross MG, and we're talking about the 10 best summer whiskeys coming right at you. I don't even know what you just said right there. Sublime. Welcome or welcome back to Stuff and Whiskey. I'm Aaron. I'm Josh. Sorry. Sounds like you almost forgot to say your name. I did almost forget to say my name, but hi, I'm Aaron. All nice right. to meet you. We're here. We do these Whiskey Talk Tuesday videos and cover all kinds of different topics. Today, we're talking about some of our favorite summer sippers. Mm -hmm. we got 10 bottles to share with you guys, and this is something our Patreon community asked for. We get this question periodically from you guys in the comments as well, so we're going to address it. And I think leading into this, one of the most important things is to categorize what even is a summer sipper. Oh, yeah. So for us, at least for me, when I think about a summer if sipper... If I disagree, I'll let you know. Yeah. I'm thinking something that's light and easy... Mm -hmm generally sweet, something that you would want to drink when the weather heats up, when the temperature yeah. gets high. For me, the caveat is not too sweet though. Yeah. I do like some sweetness in the summer, but not too sweet for me. Yeah. And generally speaking, this is something I'm going to throw in a rocks glass, probably not on ice, but I could put it on ice mm -hmm. if I wanted to. Some people love stuff on ice, but these would typically just be in a rocks glass and I would just have some sips without thinking about it while yeah. I'm hanging out hanging out socially or grilling or, you know, something like that. Yeah. That's, that would be the context in which I would pour something like this. Usually late at night, I'll pour just whatever. Yeah. And it's stuff that's not this. It's decidedly not this. Okay. So but, this is more like evening, early evening, daytime, summer sipping. Yeah. If I'm grilling, sipping. watching a game, okay. cool. hanging out, whatever. At nighttime, I'll put something in a Glencairn and, and focus on it and, and have something that's more to my taste. Gotcha. But these are just kind of generally good sippers. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Yep. And let's get Buffalo Trace stuff out of the way first. Let's do it. Eagle Rare would yep. be our first choice in the Buffalo Trace family, but Buffalo Trace itself is a great choice. And for a budget option, if you get benchmark products in your market, which they are in most markets, benchmark top floor. Now, mm. one of the key uh, distinctions of a summer sipper is something that is lower proof. Mm -hmm. Spice levels are down. You know, it's not amplifying the heat of the day. Correct. And that is key. These all fit that bill. Buffalo Trace is kind of known for that, which is why they're one of the crowd favorites out there for a lot of people. Mm -hmm. And they kind of do what they do. They do this kind of easy sipping, low spice experience about as good as anybody. And there are other ones we're going to talk about that I think rival or better them in our opinion, and some of our favorites are coming up later in this video that we prefer over most of these and can kind of go toe to toe with Eagle Rare for this type of scenario. Mm. But the problem Buffalo Trace products is they're kind of hard to find in a lot of markets, yeah. especially Eagle Rare. So let's move these out and get into our next group. And that is going to be, here's where I'm going to break my one rule. I said I wanted to keep proof low. Yeah. And for me, that usually means there's a nine and one other digit after that. Okay. I want the proof low. Okay. But generally speaking, it is hard to beat Old Forester signature stuff. So okay. the 100 proof bourbon and the 100 proof rye, they both work really well as easy summer sippers. And if it's not too hot, I can still get into the 100 proof proof point. Yeah. And these are pretty low on spice and generally speaking, quite sweet, quite enjoyable. Yeah. I mean, if you can't tell. We've gone through the rye. And this is not our first bottle no. of it. So we do use the rye a lot for cocktails. It's really, really, really good in cocktails. Mm -hmm. And the bourbon works really well in cocktails for that matter. But these are very multi-use bottles. Yeah. They're also very budget-friendly bottles, and they're in every market. I mean, both of these are $25 or less in most markets. Can't be that. You cannot beat it. So Old Forester kills it. Buffalo Trace really hits on the sweet, mm -hmm. low spice, like fruity sweet low spice front, yeah. these kind of fall in that same vein. Fruity sweet, mm -hmm. low spice, a little bit more vanilla than Buffalo Trace brings to the equation, yeah. a little less fruit, a little more vanilla. But yeah, generally speaking, fantastic bottle. So let's get them out, get into the next thing. All right. And that's going to be kind of on the heels of all these Bowman Brothers. Mm. Bowman Brothers Small Batch is a very, very, very good summer sipping product. It is 90 proof, I believe. Yep, 90 proof. Small batch, Virginia straight bourbon whiskey. Now, Bowman Brothers used to uh, source the distillate from Buffalo Trace and then run it through their copper pot distillation oh, okay. process and age it in Virginia. But they say now this is all their own distillate. 
that's going into these products. Is this bottle their own distillate? That's what they say. Okay. Tastes a lot like Buffalo Trace. <laughs> it's in a lot of markets and usually for cheaper than Buffalo Trace. So easier to find and cheaper. Bowman Brothers small batch. Great go. summer sipper. And this one, because it is cheaper than Buffalo Trace and because it's easier to find, it's one that I definitely gravitate to more. Yeah. It has that same fruity sweetness, low spice, throw it in a rocks glass, sip it while I'm, I've am i got something on so the grill. So it would be like a dupe for Buffalo Trace. Yeah, oh yeah, for sure. It could be a dupe. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. It is. As an alternative, rather than a dupe, 17... 92 Barton small batch. This is always have to look 93.7 proof. Such a weird proof point. That is kind of it's, a strange proof point. It's the only thing at that proof point, <laughs> but 93.7 great product. Again, fruit sweetness. Mm -hmm. This is the theme fruity sweet, a uh, lot of vanilla in this as well. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of leaning into that banana, cherry, vanilla wheelhouse of Barton 1792 flavors. And this stuff, as you can tell, we go through a fair bit of it. It's yeah. a great warm up pour or on a warm day. It's just a great pour to have in general. Some people, you know, 1792, they say that um, they have a high rye mash bill. And I don't know if it says it on this bottle or not, mm. but they do. They have a higher rye content in their mash bill, which some people, you know, talk don't, about don't. rye and they talk about spice and everything. Mm. It doesn't taste like a rye. It doesn't taste spicy. Mm -hmm. It just tastes like good whiskey. It's yeah. got a lot of flavor for a 93 proof. Yeah, so, and I would probably put this on ice. Yeah, in, it would hold up in the summertime well. because yeah, it would hold up. Yeah, cool, great choice. Now, let's go ahead and do our favorites. But before we do our favorites, I don't even know what you what you're bringing. I hope they're my favorites too. But before we do our favorites, a summer staple. Oh, oh gosh, is Z Biotics. Absolutely. Now, Z Biotics has been a longtime sponsor of the channel. If you know us, you know we believe in this stuff. We mm -hmm. subscribe ourselves. This box is getting almost done. Yeah. We're getting halfway there and we got the next one coming because we are subscribers. Mm -hmm. We believe in the product so much. Skeptics turn believers. Yep. It is a pre-alcohol probiotic that helps you feel your best the next morning after a night of drinking. And I don't know who doesn't want that. And for me, that is a very valuable thing. I want that. There have been a few times since we found out about Zbiotics that I forgot to take it mm -hmm. and I, you can tell. I could tell the next day. I just didn't feel my best. And mm -hmm. I want to feel my best mm -hmm. if I'm having some pours, having a good time. And truthfully speaking, that's what summertime is all about. Yeah. Having some pours, having a good time, friends and family, loved ones. So drink z before drinking, and it will help you feel your best the next day. Because ain't nobody got time to be feeling anything other than their very, very best. Absolutely. We're getting too old. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> yeah. So check out Zbiotics down in the video description below. There's a link. You can see it on the screen here. You got the QR code there. We have a discount code. Save yourself some money. Yeah. Fif is it 15%? 15. And then if you, if you subscribe, then you can get a, a, some money off for subscribing as well, which stacks on top of the discount. Little pro tip. And mm -hmm. most of all, if it doesn't work for you, for some reason, they have a money back guarantee that they will make good on. They stand so by their product. Yeah. There's literally no risk. All reward. There you go. It's a win-win. Treat yourself. <laughs> Treat yourself to a better summer with Zbiotics. Absolutely. Like, man, that was like Good. the most... <laughs> well, did you script that? No, I did not. <laughs> That's like the most addy thing I've ever said. But it is true. We wouldn't have them sponsoring if we, we didn't not. believe in them. If... We, we take very few sponsorships, and they are one that we've been they've been sponsoring us for a long time. Yeah, I say no to at least five or ten sponsorships a week. Yeah. And we they're one of, one of the very few sponsors on the channel. All right, let's get into our... Favorites. Let's do it. So let's do it. Jack Daniels single barrels. Oh yes. Now, these are more expensive. These are proofy though. No, no, these aren't the barrel proof. Oh, the, this is not the, the barrel proof. The, Sorry, I got excited. The gold label is the barrel proof. These are the black labels. I do like the barrel proof though. 90, but these are good. Ninety-four proof. Oh okay. Yeah, this yeah. happens to be our pick that we did last mm. year. Which, by the way, speaking of barrel picks, if you're interested in barrel picks that we do, get in on Patreon mm. over there. That's where we release our barrel picks. They go in tiered order. So sign up at whatever level you're comfortable with, including free. So you can get in on our barrel pick releases, mm -hmm. even for free. If they make it through all the paid tiers, you can get in on it over there. Absolutely. We also have an amazing community for our paid members that is just a, a wonderful group of people that you couldn't ask to be better associated Great. with. Yeah, yeah. I'm surprised they even associate with us, but they let us be a part of it. I know, right? Check that out down there. And yeah, anyways, Jack Daniels, yes. single barrels. 
these are more pricey this is like the elevated summer pour. Mm. Like you want something in your glass, but it's not gonna necessarily be in the background. Okay. You don't want it to disappear. You wanna really enjoy it and savor it. Okay. Maybe maybe you're not grilling, maybe you're not cooking, maybe you're not doing this, that, and the other, and you're actually just sitting on the porch and you want something good in your glass okay. and you wanna enjoy it. Sitting by the pool. But you want the proof to be lower. Okay. You don't want your face blown off with proof because mm -hmm. otherwise I'd say you can get the barrel proof of this and even put that on ice. Mm. But something you can have a few glasses of over the course of time and this stuff is hard to beat. Yeah. Again, fruity sweet, low spice, heavy vanilla. It's almost like there's a theme here with all the bottles that we're picking. But this stuff is awesome. It does run about 50 to 60 bucks a bottle. So again, yeah. the other bottles that have been in this list, Eagle Rare can get pricey 40, 50, Depending 60 bucks where you live, yeah. or more. But a lot of the bottles in this list are like 25 to $30. So that's kind of the wheelhouse for yeah. good summer bottles, but can't say enough good things about Jack Daniels. If you've not tried this, by the way, look how gorgeous this bottle is. Like if you've not tried these before, you owe it to yourself to try one. Yeah. They are single barrels, so they will vary in <laughs> flavor. And sometimes you get a really good one, Sometimes you get one that's maybe not so good. It's a little bit of single barrel roulette, as we call it, mm -hmm. but fantastic product. Yeah. One we will always have at least one or two or three bottles of around, which is a true statement yeah. in this house almost all the time. It is. You think he's exaggerating. He's not. All right. Our last one. Oh. The real favorite. I saw it, and I'm so excited that you're going to bring this up. The real favorite. The real for us. winner. Now, this is not available in every market, but if it's in your market, it's going to be readily available. Yes. Hard truth, high road dry. Yes. And just the regular, fairly new to market, small batch bourbon. Now yes. this is 90 proof straight bourbon whiskey, non-chill filtered. These are made in Nashville, Indiana, mm -hmm. and their straight rye is 93 proof. And if you're not a rye person, do not discount this rye. If you can get it, yeah, it's worth it to try it because this guy loves it and he doesn't like yeah. really much rise it's sweet it's for for a rye it's very sweet but it's not overly sweet mm -hmm. it's got enough in there for everybody to love and the spice is not high it's not going to light your tongue up with a peppery sensation but it's got a lot of flavor it's got a lot of flavor for low proof and this bourbon actually before this video not right now but a few days ago i actually tried this next to buffalo trace in a rocks glass and i actually had you try it too blind i handed you two glasses and oh. i was like try these and you tried them and you're like, oh, pretty, pretty good. Yeah. Which one do you prefer? Oh, this one, easy. That was this. Sweet. He hands me stuff all the time and I just drink it. Yeah. I don't even know. I don't, I don't ask. Yeah. That's like <laughs> terrible, uh, you know, I mean, you get yourself in some trouble. You're my husband. I'm not going to take drinks from a stranger. <laughs> yeah. But this stuff is so good, man. I love what Hard Truth is doing. I mean, these bottles, look how gorgeous this bottle is. Yeah. I mean, I mean, just look how gorgeous this is with the labeling and everything. It's got this embossed, like, on the back, I mean, they yeah. just do and such a good job. And their corks are so cool. Like, they're, yeah. like, I don't know. Which people say you drink with your eyes a little bit, too. So, we like, but these things hold up in blind tastings for us. They do. They do. I, I'm a sucker for a pretty bottle, but if the whiskey in the bottle isn't good, I'm not going to pay a premium for a pretty bottle. Yeah. And this stuff, you're not paying a premium for, but the whiskey is also very good. Yeah. Now, price point, 35 40 bucks on both yeah. these. Maybe a little bit more expensive than some of the things that are on this list, but you're honestly getting a really good product. It's not the most mainstream thing out there. You can are take it to a summer pool party or something. Do you know if they're coming into more markets? They are. Okay. But you can take this to like a summer pool party or a backyard barbecue or something, and you can bring something that other people maybe haven't had. A lot of people probably haven't tried and it you or can heard of it. Really impress them because I, I would be stunned if anybody didn't like either one of these. They're awesome. Yeah. They're just awesome. And we love what Hard Truth is doing. By the way, if you're ever in or around the Indianapolis area, you owe it to yourself to take a trip over to Hard Truth in Brown County and check them out. But we just can't say enough good things I'll about take, them. I'll take this one over here. This one's yeah. fine. But yeah, those are our summer sippers. Down in the comments below, let us know what your favorite summer sippers are. Very curious. Yeah. I mean, tis the season. We always need some good recommendations on summer sippers. But again, keep the price in check. Keep the proof kind of low. These are things you just want to be able to generally enjoy. Yep. And if you generally enjoyed this video, think about liking it and subscribing to the channel yeah. because this is a style of content we do every Tuesday over here. And we also have a ton of blind tastings where you can see all these sorts of bottles get compared to other things and remove all the bias and actually see if they stand up or not when we don't know what's in our glass. Yep. So that's a good way for us to 
give you some reactions that can serve as your reviews. Again, check out the Patreon yeah. and check out stuffandwhiskey.com if you would like to get in on some awesome shirts over there. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it for today. Yeah. Be good to each other. And until next time. Have a good and safe summer. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. And have a good and safe summer. 